Which of the following statements is true about first pass metabolism? Option A. Blood perfusing through gastrointestinal tissues passes through the liver via hepatic portal vein. B. 70% of the rectal blood supply bypasses the liver. C. Drugs absorbed in the buccal cavity bypass the liver. D. Both A and C. After a medication is taken by mouth, it gets absorbed through the walls of the small intestine and transported into the liver via the portal vein. Once in the liver, hepatic enzymes work on the medication to metabolize it. This process is known as first-pass metabolism or first-pass effect and is responsible for breaking down most medications into their inactive metabolites. As well as converting certain prodrugs into their active metabolites, before entering the general circulation. This however means that if a medication is undergoes extensive first-pass metabolism, their concentration in the bloodstream can get so reduced. So once they reach their site of action they can't produce the desired effect. In that case, alternative routes of administration should be considered, including intravenous, intramuscular, transdermal, sublingual, or inhalation administration. What these do is bypass the first pass effect, allowing medications to go straight into the systemic circulation and produce their effect. Therefore the answer is option A. If you find this video helpful, share it with others who may find it helpful too. Subscribe Medbook for more videos like this and thanks for watching.